In this video I'm going to be talking about Umadigi Bison Phone. Umadigi is one of the leading rugged phone and mid-budget smartphone manufacturing company. They have certain reputation for building high-quality handset at lower price. They have proved it again with their new Umadigi Bison Rugged Phone. When all of the rugged phone manufacturer company played their top card in the market Umadigi played its trump card and bid everyone out. Umadigi Bison is a $300 rugged which you can buy from AliExpress. But the matter of the fact is, how good this rugged phone? Is it worth money? And, why should you buy this phone? All of these questions will be answered throughout this in-depth review of the Umadigi Bison rugged phone. Let's start with checking the key features of this rugged phone. Key features. Rugged certifications, IP68, IP69K display size, 6.3 inch IPS LCD display. Display resolution, 1080x 2340 pixels. Processor, Mediatek Helio P60. GPU, ARM Mali G72 MP3. Operating system, Android 10. Rear camera, 48 MP plus 16 MP plus 5 MP plus 5 MP. Front camera, 24 MP. Storage, 128 GB of 2.1. RAM, 6 GB LPDDR4. Battery, 5000 mAh. Network, dual 4G SIM. Sensors, side-mounted fingerprint sensor, barometer, proximity sensor, ambient light sensor, accelerometer, gyroscope. The phone can survive harsh weather conditions and is resistant to damage from water, dust, and accidental drops. And better yet, the specs are comparable to other non-rugged smartphones in the same price segment. The massive body of the Umadigi Bison houses the 6.3 FHD Plus IPS LCD display that has a screen resolution of 2340x1080. This gives us a PPI of 409, guaranteeing that you won't be seeing any pixels. Overall, it is a fantastic display for the price, both in terms of screen quality and size. Picking a display of bigger would make this phone unwieldy once you add on all the extra armor. And to protect the display from scratches or cracks, Umadigi chose a Corning Gorilla glass covering, although there's no mention of which generation. Taking the Bison outside showed us that it's not the brightest display we've tested here at Review Hub, but it's still usable outdoors, just not in direct bright sunlight. Not just that, but the edges of the phone boasts slightly elevated bumps which makes sure the screen doesn't come in contact with the ground during a drop, thereby saving it from being shattered by the impact. And with a military standard drop rating of 1.5 meters, you can rest assured this is a display that isn't going to break easily, the Umadigi Bison isn't meant to look sleek nor slim. It has a noticeable bulk at 12.8 millimeters thickness, which is standard for most rugged smartphones. But at only 250 grams, it's fairly pocket-friendly. The weight is evenly distributed and not centered around the top or bottom, which does make it easier to handle. By the time you add a 20 grams case to a non-rugged smartphone, you're in similar weight territory. The solid polycarbonate built of the device provides an ensuring grip, so you don't need to worry about the bison accidental slipping out of your hand. But on the off chance that you do, it is manufactured to withstand a 1.5 meters drop without bruising. So unless you played on your local basketball team growing up, the 3. The Umadigi Bison ships with a quad camera shooter on the back. This includes the popular 48MP snapper from Sony that is often touted as one of the best smartphone cameras in the low to mid-tier market. To complement the main camera, we have a 16MP wide-angle lens that covers a 120 degrees field of view. Other than this, there is a 5MP macro camera for taking those close-up shots and a 5MP depth sensor to capture more details on the main lens. On the front, the Umadigi Bison sports a 24MP Sony selfie camera inside the teardrop notch. It is AI-powered and can take some awesome selfies with great edge detection to help you apply those stunning Baca filters. As far as video capabilities are concerned, both the front and rear cameras can shoot videos at up to 1080p at 30fps. Sadly, you can't get an option for 4K video recording, but at this price point, I'll forgive the Bison. However, I would have appreciated seeing an option that allows capturing videos at 60fps at a lower resolution, but sadly that too is not possible. Now, with that being said, if you can live with a max camera resolution of 1080p and a max frame rate of 30fps, then there isn't much to complain about. The autofocus in the Bison is pretty good. But, 
the sheer lack of any sort of image or video stabilization means the videos are going to be shaky if you don't have steady hands. Rear camera, 48MP Sony primary camera. 16MP ultra wide angle camera with 120 degrees field of view. 5MP depth camera. 5MP macro camera, 2.5 cm macro distance. Front camera, selfie time, 24MP Sony ultra clear front camera with f2.0 aperture. Performance. Under the hood, the Umidigi Bison is powered by the Mediatek Helio P60 SOC system on chip, which is currently over two years old. So why did Umidigi choose to go with such an old chipset? The Umidigi Bison is a 4G volt compatible smartphone that can take in two 4G enabled SIMs at the same time. However, because of the hybrid SIM slot, you will need to choose whether you want to have two SIMs or a single SIM paired with an external MicroSD card for expanding the onboard memory. Finally coming to the sensors, it seems that Umidigi decided to cram in every possible sensor we have come to expect from a smartphone including a proximity sensor, accelerometer, ambient light sensor, gyroscope, which are a staple with most smartphones these days. The Umidigi Bison is powered by healthy 5000 mAh battery that can easily give you a full day of battery backup with moderate to heavy usage. Casual users can potentially stretch it to 1.5 days. This is perfect when you are considering that the phone is targeted at travelers and adventurers who won't get the chance to charge their phone twice or thrice a day. Also, when they do come around to charge the Bison, it charges back up in a jiffy thanks to the 18W fast charger bundled inside the box. With a weight of 250 grams though, it's have been nice if Umidigi had squeezed in a little more juice and pushed the Bison to 6000 ma like many of its competitors. If you are in the market for a rugged smartphone then the Umidigi Bison is definitely worth your consideration. It comes loaded with tons of awesome features and the price to performance ratio is spot on. It boasts a decent display paired with a big battery and a certified rugged build that won't fall prey to regular wear and tear. Other than this, the camera system is a nice bonus and the performance is as you would expect considering the $150 price point. I think Umidigi made the right choice, that is choosing better camera hardware over a top-end mobile CPU. If you're looking for a feature-rich rugged phone to head out on your next adventures with, the Umidigi Bison has your back. In conclusion, this is one of the best products you can find in the markets right now. I hope this video showed you the great features of this product. Do you learn some coolest stuff in today's video? Make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel right now. Just click on the subscribe button below this video. Now I want to turn it over to you and ask you this, what do you like most about this product? Let me know by leaving a comment below right now.